What's up, everybody? A spare with a gun here from Sleepless Nights with another episode on Subnautica, starting off our new season. Uh, we had talked about that in the last episode, that it was kind of time for a new season, just because uh, there was a lot of new stuff. Open storage. We've already got some stuff. Lithium. Computer chip, computer chip, flashlight. Alright. Is there anything else? I don't think so. Now, I'm a little pressed for time here, uh, because we need this radiation suit, which is two silicone and two lead, um, before the ship blows up, so that we need four quartz and six copper, two silver. That's a tall order, I gotta, be, I gotta say. So this is our new starting point. Now, we look like we're a little bit further away, so I suppose it's possible that we might not get affected. Um, because normally you get blowed up. Um, and I don't want to speak too soon, but I kind of feel like... Give me the, give me the, give me the fish! Give, give me the... Scanning the Aurora. Zero life signs no, detected. No, no. Lethal radiation levels detected. The main drive core has malfunctioned. The primary dark matter containment field has dropped to 36% amplitude. Continuing to monitor the 10 seconds of oxygen remaining. Got, gotcha, gotcha, thank you, lady. Man, she's multitasking. Um, so we got three copper. Um, I don't know how much of this I'm actually going to show because I want to get kind of a foothold going. Scrap metal everywhere. Now, I don't want to speak too soon. Ooh, quartz, yes. But it does seem I'm gonna I'm gonna possibly jinx myself a little bit here. Uh, it does seem as though the game is running much smoother. That could be because there's no clutter in the world, like all of our huge base. Emergency. Ten seconds of oxygen Just remaining. Having like a hundred and some seconds. Um, so it could be that. It could just be that it's a new fresh world and we're not dealing with a bunch of clutter everywhere. I don't know, really, to be quite honest. Uh, give me... No. I don't like these things. They put poison. It's annoying. I need, like, one more quartz. Actually, no. What I need to be looking for is a red forest. Because if I can find a red kelp forest, I can find more silver, there's quartz. Um, so yeah, the world is supposed to be completely different now. Like, we restarted the whole thing. There's a fragment I'm gonna want. Seamoth. Yay. I probably shouldn't be carrying my computer chips and all that crap on. Emergency. Ten seconds of oxygen remaining. We got this, we got this. Um, tell you what, I'm gonna pause it and I'm gonna keep looking for all the stuff that we need. If I get it or the ship's gonna blow up, whichever comes first, um, then I will come back and we'll go from there. Nine. All right. Eight, so we're getting seven, the countdown now. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Here we go. Time for the boom. I love that shockwave. That shockwave is just awesome. Now the question is... That's new. You gotta be kidding me. All the way over here? See, that's the problem. I don't know how to get back to the fabricator. Uh, we have done some serious work, though. I managed to get... All this crap. <laughs> I've got... Um, three workbench bench fragments, which is great. Means we won't have to go looking for workbench. A terraformer fragment, seamoth fragments, um, lithium, which didn't know I could. Oh no, we got that already. Never mind. We got the two silver. We have four copper, so I have four quartz. So I really need two copper. That's it. I need two copper, and then we can make a red suit. If I can make it back to fabricator in the life pod fast enough. 
Um, so I'm kind of headed back towards the spawn area. But I'm trying to kind of keep my distance a little bit, just in case I start hearing the Geiger counter thing go off. Which I'm kind of hoping won't happen, but I'm kind of expecting it to. I mean, I could see them changing it, because I don't know if that was really intentional or not. It's great that those, like, fill up my health now. Oh, beeper! Beeper! Come here! Come here! Where'd he go? Come here! Come here! What food? Dag it. I miss my stasis rifle. Already. We're gonna have a water problem here in a second, though, if I keep eating food like that. Oh, look at all the quartz! Oh, wait, that's not I guess there's three. I don't know if there's more. Emergency. Ten seconds of oxygen remaining. Can I get it? Can I get it? Yes! Oh, look at those mad skills. up this course because I've got a few fragments I can dump if I start running out of room and we can always use quartz. That's stupid, that's stupid, that's stupid. Emergency. Ten seconds of oxygen remaining. Can't see them putting like a stasis rifle close. Yeah. I need limestone so that I can get copper though. That's what I really need right now. Um, let me keep working here. I'll see what I can find. So I might have been a little preemptive and borderline crazy paranoid lunatic. Um, so they did fix it. <laughs> Because I'm swimming along over here, kind of acting like a snorkeling tourist, just do 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 do, swim swim swim. Um, not paying attention to where I am, and I'm going along. La -da -dee -dee -dee. Look up, and I'm like, oh, I'm past the escape pod, so obviously I don't actually need the rad suit. So yeah, a little bit crazy on my part. This is something I don't really understand. Well, okay, for the water, we're just water. I don't really understand. We talked a little about this in the last um, episode of the last season where it's kind of like I don't really get why I need to. Um, what is this? Oh, magnesium. Okay, I can make one lead. Are we sure it's. Oh, there's no helmet anymore. That's the difference. Okay. Okay. And I'm also going to need a builder, which I need a battery for, so I need some more copper. And... Well, I'm wondering if I should work on, like, some other stuff now, like flippers and air tanks. Glass. Let's do that. Screw the rad suit. We don't need a rad suit right now. Um, I was thinking I needed one, but I guess I don't. So, there's no real reason to make one. At the moment, anyway. Um, I am gonna put the silver in here, because that's probably gonna be the harder one to find. Um, let's actually put all this fragments and stuff back in there. We'll put the gold in there. I don't really need gold right now. I need to drink water. Yeah, so let me do some work. And I will be back in a moment. So, remember that time that I said I wasn't going to make a radiation suit? Yeah. <laughs> oh. Oh, we get the whole kit and caboodle, huh? Oh, there's gloves now. That's interesting. Um, so yeah, I had already made fins. I made fins, a knife, a builder, and I just happened to have what I needed still to make a rad suit, so I went ahead and made it. Um, even though it doesn't really, isn't really necessary right now. Caution. Blood nutrient levels decreasing. Yeah, so Calories here's something. The cured... Now we actually have experimentation. Cured boomerang is boomerang plus salt deposit. Cooked is just boomerang. 
Just the fish, right? Nothing else, right? So explain this to me. Cured, 21 food, minus two water. Oh, decomposing, that's what it is. There we go, there we go. Because when you first cook it, it was 20 something like the cured one, but it was plus three H2O. I see how this is. Let's let's actually go experiment with this. Um, I'm looking for a boomerang. A boomerang. I wonder if we should actually try and venture in towards the Aurora now that I've got my rad suit. Oh, and I was so mad that, um, what was the other thing that I wanted to make? Not the builder. I had the builder already. Man, what was the other thing? There was some other tool that I wanted to make. And it requires, like, two more silver. And I was like, really? I see a boomerang shadow. Where's, where's he at? Dude, I'm getting... That's what it was. I need to seriously grab this fish. Emergency. Right. Ten seconds of oxygen remaining. We can make it. We can make it. That was really a bit close. New creature discovered. Alright, so let's just cook these. I love that feature though. That if you um, cook them, then they, they give you plus H2O. I love that. anymore. Kind of found that out the hard way. That was not fun. Um, nighttime approaches. So let's see. I'm gonna... I'm running a bit out of time to record this episode, to be quite honest. Um, so I'm probably not gonna do any more cutting. I wanted to. Uh, but I just don't have the recording time available at this time. Because I was trying to do all my pre-recording for the weekend. I have some plans on the weekend. I have uh, some family stuff going on. And I have a couple of uh, super secret projects that I'm working on. I wanted to put some more time into. Uh, that you should hopefully be seeing fairly soon. Um, so I need to find that red forest again. There is a red forest that I found. I don't know if I was filming when I found that or not. I think I was. But now that I've got flippers and at least one tank, um, I should be able to pretty well. I mean, I should be able to get to it pretty well. I could do it before. And there is that, um... There is a newer feature, I guess you could call it. So I need two silver. Uh, where, let's say, we're swimming like this. Um, if I'm, this is, well, I'll show you right now. This is me holding forward. Now, if I hit C to pull down, you can see we kind of speed up a little bit. Works the same way going back up. That if you hold spacebar and hit the back key, back key, um, you can end up raising up faster. Spadefish! Love spadefish. Especially now that they've changed the food mechanic. I should have brought my flashlight with me, I wasn't thinking. Can I eat these? I've always wanted to eat these. I'm not... Like, they don't show up, so I guess I probably can't. It's probably a no-go. Uh, I want to go for quartz. I will grab these guys. But seriously, like, that's so cool that that basically means in small quantities, you could actually eat, remaining. like, peepers and stuff. Let's climb. You could actually eat, like, peepers and stuff to restore your water. If you 
fucking football. Which I was like, that's kind of amazing. And that kind of changes the whole dynamic of the, the food system. Speak fish! seconds of oxygen remaining. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I kind of feel like, um, the guy from the Lego movie where he's like, Spaceship! Spaceship! I can build a spaceship! Alright. Um, let me swim back here. I am gonna cut this out, because this is just gonna be swimming. Just keep swimming, just keep swimming. Alright, so we're back at the little light pod. Um, I did think of something on the way over here. Um, I'm wondering... I'm wondering if I should actually leave these. Now, the reason I say that is because I'm wondering if we leave them, if they'll go bad on their own. If the only way to keep them preserved is curing them. I'm not sure. So I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to cure a fish. Like the spade fish. I'm going to cook another spade fish, and then I'm going to leave the other one raw. And we are going to compare them by throwing them in here. Because uh, I'm going to need some of this material, I think. Like the computer chip. Need these fragments. So, yeah, let's put in one normal spade fish, the cooked one, and the cured. Now, it is important to note they nerf this to where the spade fish don't just give you plus food and no H2O uh, raw. The only way to do it is to cook them. Even the cured one is negative. Um, so, there's that. Episode of the season already into sea bases. What is happening? The world's coming to an end. Alright, now is the power generator. Man, the power generator is still for titanium. How many do I have? Plenty. Alright, well, let's just attach this right here then. I don't know if I'll need it. Uh, the short version is that 
that the workbench is supposed to give us new stuff, like we can upgrade our knife and our fins, and I really want to do that. The knife, that's some of the new stuff you can do, which is epic, and I, I can't wait. That's the kind of stuff I wanted to get into, actually, um, is all that kind of stuff. That's why I wanted to start a new season was, um, actually, and you might notice the terrain does look different. Like, it's laid out differently. It's not quite the same code that we were in before, where it's a complete circle. Actually, some more stuff. Now, one thing I would like to know from you guys is if anyone can confirm to me um, the respawn traits of materials now at this current version, this current juncture. Junction? Junction. 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 I think is the proper term. Um, because I just would like to know because I don't want to like use up all of my resources doing stupid crap. Find out. I can't get in the back, you know, kind of thing. Um, and like fish and you know, all that kind of stuff. Um, I really love that I can just cook them with power. Like that's awesome. Um, what do I need? Oh, I need something stupid for the welder. Crash powder. That's right. Yeah, that's not gonna happen for a minute. Um. So, tell you what, let's go back down and visit our little mini base here. Let's see if it'll tell me what we're at. 33%. I'm at least going to let this complete because I want to see what the requirements and stuff are for the um, workbench, and then we'll wrap things up here. Alright, so I just got the notification that our workbench is done scanning. So we need a wiring kit, another wiring kit of course, another computer chip. And we should have everything else, which... What did I do with that other computer chip? I feel like I had another one. And it's not in here, and it's not in my inventory. Did I use them both? We had two computer chips, didn't we? Am I losing my mind? I didn't use it for anything in the base. I mean, I used one for that, right? Wiring kit and computer chip. It's basically the same exact thing. Aha! So we probably won't have one for a minute. Um, but we can see how this one works. <laughs> it's called, uh, supply and demand. Just kind of switch it Alrighty. Oh, this looks cool. Heat blade. I need a battery and a burning hot blade. Diamond blade. Ultra sharp. Ooh. I think I want two. <laughs> Tanks. <gasps> Plasteel tank. Extra light tank. Extra air capacity. Tank and titanium. So, I'm gonna go out on a limb and say... It'll take up more room than four, but it will be uh, more air, and the smaller one will take up less. That is sweet! Ultra glide flin fins increase swim speed, charges your held tool while you swim? What? What? That is amazing! Charges your held tool. So stasis rifle if we had a heat blade. Oh my gosh. I think for now I'm going to do this one. What? 105? Oh, it doesn't even take up any more room. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is like my new favorite game ever. Again. I keep saying that all the time. Alright, so we're going to end the episode here on that note. In the meantime, I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, and I will see you all next time. Peace!